Hey, 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 welcome back to Food According to El Roca. So this, this morning we are making some blueberry muffins that are so delicious, guys. Just make them and then you'll tell me later. So we're going to need two cups of flour, one teaspoon of um, salt and two teaspoons of baking powder. Put that through a sieve so that you know what, it's fluffy and nice. So just do that first and put, put it into your bowl. And then if after doing that, put it aside and then we're going to need a half a cup of um, butter. Uh, I made sure that butter is soft. If it's a little bit uh, still, you know, hard, you can put it a little bit for 10 seconds in the microwave. And then you're going to use your hand mixer to, to fluff that up. And then we're going to put a three quarter cups of uh, caster sugar, caster sugar uh, into your bowl, into that uh, butter. And then from there, you're going to mix that up and fluff that up until it's mixed and fluffy and then we're gonna put two eggs into that so i use two eggs and make sure your eggs are room temperature they are not too cold and after putting those two eggs i put two teaspoons of vanilla essence that will give it a nice nice flavor so i put some vanilla essence in there and then i'm gonna beat my mixture with a hand mixer to make sure that you know, it, it becomes nice and soft and fluffy. And then from there, I added a, a zest of one lemon. You can add that. This is just a, you know, an addition and it gives it a nice flavor. You can skip this if you don't want the lemon or if maybe you are allergic to cit a, a, a citrus um, things or whatever. Like you can skip that. It's not highly necessary. And then from there, after mixing that up, making sure it's thoroughly mixed. And then you're going to start adding... Uh, your flour, flour mixture, and the milk. So the milk is like three quarter cups of milk. But with the flour and the milk, you're going to add a uh, half of that uh, and then mix. And then you're going to add the, the next half. So you don't mix it. You don't put it in at the same time. You're going to put half of the flour and half of the milk. And then from there, you're going to put uh, the rest of the flour and the rest of the milk. And then you're going to mix that up. And if you want it to be a little bit sour, like if you want to add that sour, you know, uh, th a thing in that, in that mixture, you can add, you can use uh, a buttermilk instead of a normal, your normal milk. You can use some, some buttermilk. It, it will also add, you know, that zing, like you do, that sour taste in there. And it's also delicious. It's a variation. That's if you want. And then from there, you're going to take one cup of blueberries and then you're going to dust them with some flour so that they don't sink into the muffins when you bake them. So you dust it with the flour and that when you dust or dust that with flour, you know what? It creates some air pockets so that it doesn't sink to the bottom of the muffins. So that's why we, we, we're dusting them with, with some flour. And then you're going to add your, your blueberries in there and then you're going to... Um, I fold them in don't over mix just fold them in there and make sure they are evenly uh, spread and then you're gonna you're gonna start putting your mixture into your muffin tin that's what you do and then i put a little bit more of the blueberries on top just so that you know what i have more blueberries on top so that they show up on my on my on my muffins and then from there you put it into your oven at uh, 180 degrees top and bottom elements for about 20 minutes or until they turn golden brown you can test it with a knife you can just put your knife through that if it comes out clean they are ready so guys i hope you're gonna enjoy this recipe and try it out and please comment and let me know how you found it and if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing thank you so much for coming back and watching this video till the next video